React is fantastic for building dynamic user interfaces. As our React applications grow, they often involve a lot of JavaScript code. This code needs to be bundled together and sent to the user's browser. Large JavaScript bundles can significantly slow down your app's initial loading time. Imagine a user trying to access your app. A large bundle means they have to wait longer for the page to become interactive. This delay can lead to a poor user experience, especially on slower connections or devices. Users don't like to wait. A slow loading app can lead to higher bounce rates and lower user engagement. This is where code splitting comes in. It's a technique that can drastically improve your app's performance. Code splitting is like dividing a large pizza into smaller slices. Instead of forcing the browser to download the entire application's code up front, we can split it into smaller, manageable chunks. These chunks are then loaded on demand, only when needed. React provides a powerful mechanism for code splitting using and allows us to dynamically import components when they are needed. Let's us display a fallback component while the dynamically imported component is loading. This approach ensures that users only download the code necessary for the initial view. As they navigate to different parts of the application, the relevant code chunks are fetched and loaded, providing a smoother and faster user experience. Let's say you have a component called that is quite large and only used in a specific section of your app. With you can dynamically import this component instead of bundling it with the rest of your code. Import React, Lazy, Suspense, from React. Const heavy component equal sign lazy, equal sign import, heavy component. Const my component equal sign, equal sign, return. In this example, takes a function that returns a promise. This promise resolves to the dynamically imported component, is used to wrap the component being lazily loaded. It takes a prop, which is a React element to render while the component is loading. Section four, example, splitting a component. Imagine you're building an e-commerce app. Your product page might have multiple tabs like description, reviews, and shipping. You can split the code for each tab into separate chunks. Import React, lazy, suspense from React. Const product description equal sign lazy, equal sign import product description. Const product reviews equal sign lazy, equal sign import product reviews. Const product shipping equal sign lazy, equal sign import product shipping. Const product details equal sign, equal sign slash slash logic to determine the active tab return. Loading tab. Active tab equal sign equal sign equal sign description and end active tab equal sign equal sign equal sign reviews and end active tab equal sign equal sign equal sign shipping and and. Now, the code for each tab is loaded only when the user clicks on that specific tab, improving the initial loading time of the product page. Section 5. Handling Errors Gracefully What happens if there's an error while loading a component? We use error boundaries to gracefully handle these situations. Class error boundary extends react.component, constructor props, super props, this dot, state equal sign, has error, media, developer thinking while coding, debugging code on screen, false, static, get derived, state from error, error, return, has error, media, computer screen with error message, programmer analyzing code on monitor, true, component did catch error, error info, slash slash, you can log the error to a service like Sentry Console. Error, error, error info. Render. If this dot state dot has error, return. Something went wrong. Return this dot props dot children. Wrap your lazily loaded components with this to display a user-friendly message in case of loading errors. Section six. Conclusion, a faster future. Code splitting is an essential technique for optimizing the performance of your React applications. By breaking down your code base into smaller, manageable chunks, you can significantly improve your app's loading time and provide a better user experience. Reacts and components make implementing code splitting straightforward. By adopting these practices, you can ensure that your React applications are fast, responsive, and a joy to use. There's a lot more to explore with code splitting. Check out the React documentation to dive deeper into advanced techniques and optimizations.